Good morning, holy cow. I am so glad you could be with me today. Oh, good morning to you too, Mr. Kevin. This is Christmas season. Can I sing a song? <laughs> no, you cannot sing. <laughs> oh, man. Holy cow, I have heard you sing, and others have heard you sing, and I just don't think it's a good idea for you to sing. You can't carry a tune in a bucket. Oh, no, because I ain't got phones. Well, okay. Well, hey, friends, what do you think? Should we let Holy Cow sing today? I mean, it is against my better judgment to allow him to sing because I can guarantee it's not going to be very good. What? You want him to sing? All right. It's your choice, not mine. All right. Lay, 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 What are you doing? I was warming up my open cord. Don't want to hurt self, do you? No, I don't want you to get hurt, but go ahead and sing. All right, <clears throat> here goes. Jesus loves the little children. All oh, the children of the world. Yellow, red, and yellow, tank, and green. Strangest kid I ever seen. Wait a minute, that's not how that song goes. What what did you ever do with that money your mother gave you for singing lessons? Walk fishing stuff. And then I took my brother fishing. You took your brother fishing? Sure did, used him as bait. Boy, that story sounds strangely familiar. Hmm. Speaking of strange, have you ever met somebody that seems strange? Duh, I'll hang out with you, don't I? Hey, wait a minute. Yeah, because he's the only one I know who talks to cows and plays with dolls. Holy cow, some people, though, seem strange to us, and they seem strange to us if they are not like us. Well, that's all harder to, and it, this is harder to do to you, or you start telling them about something in the devil. Yes, it is. You're right. Uh, now, holy cow, since it's Christmas time, let's hear something about a time before Jesus was born. Well, a long time ago when you was little. No, holy cow. But in the Bible, before Jesus was born, he had a cousin that was born. Cousins are the best. Yes, cousins are a lot of fun. Well, he, his cousin grew up. It was just a little bit older than Jesus was. And he went around preparing people to know about Jesus. And he was, some people thought he was kind of strange. First of all, his name was John the Baptist. How was he strange? Did he have green hair, a tail, and eat weird things like sushi? No. John the Baptist was the son of Zechariah and Elizabeth, and God gave them a son when they were old, and God sent him to prepare the way for Jesus. Now, he wore camel skin, had a leather belt, and ate locusts and wild honey. Hey, my family helped hold him together. What? A leather deal. Okay, okay. Well, what, what's amazing and awesome about John is that he didn't worry about what other people thought about him. It wasn't about what John could do, but what God could do through him. And he told a lot of people about Jesus was coming and they needed to confess their sins and turn away from the bad things and they needed to follow Jesus. And it shows us that we can be like John. Oh, I ain't gonna eat no locusts. Besides, I want a new diet, a scream diet. The scream diet? I've never heard of the scream diet. Uh-huh, you scream, I scream, we all scream for ice cream and takes a two. <sighs> Holy cow, we are all a little strange in our own way, but that's how God made us. John was preparing the way for Jesus to come and make a difference for everyone. Some people may have a learning struggle. They Sometimes it's hard for them to learn or read or do something. It's not a disability. It's the way God made them. And we read in Psalms 139, I am fearfully and wonderfully made. Because God made us so we can know who he is. And we is. Yes, God made us so we can learn who he wants us to be. What makes you different than everybody else? Well, I guess I was different than the other cats because 
I can talk and help you tell others about Jesus and prepare the way. Oh, yes, you do help me uh, tell others, and, and we help them learn so that they know that Jesus is coming and we prepare the way. Um, that's good, holy cow. And our friends can do that as well. They can help prepare the way for others to know Jesus in what they say, what they think, and what they do to others, and letting others see Jesus in them. Now, say goodbye, holy cow. Oh, I want to sing another song. Well, you know what? You want to sing another song? I'd like you to sing On a Hill Far Away. All right, let me get warmed up. No, 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 you didn't hear me. I want you to sing On a Hill Far, Far Away so I can't hear you. Oh, man. Say goodbye, holy cow. Goodbye, holy cow. Y'all take care. Brush your hair.